Being a K-pop idol means dealing with immense pressure to stay young and beautiful. And it's no secret that the diet culture in K-pop is famously tough, involving severe food restrictions and intense workouts. Both aspiring trainees and famous idols have spoken out about these risky diets, admitting they regretted following them. Now, let's explore some of the most extreme cases and never, ever try any of these diets. 9. Paper Cup Diet Girl group Nine Muses, who debuted in August of 2010, instantly became a hot topic due to the fact that most members used to be models. They're known for their tall, slim figures with an average height of 172 centimeters. One member even has a waist as tiny as 22.5 inches or about 57 centimeters. But staying slim isn't always easy. On an episode of SBSE's Star Beauty Show, one member spilled the beans about their paper cup diet. According to this plan, every meal should fit into three paper cups. One for fruit, one for rice, and one for side dishes. And no, these are not the large paper cups used for soft drinks at fast food joints, but rather the tiny ones typically used for water dispensers. The girls also noted the importance of not exceeding the brim of the cups. Additionally, they emphasized that the rice should be brown or mixed grain, and salty or greasy foods should be avoided. These girls spend up to seven hours a day in the dance studio plus extra exercise. It's hard to imagine getting through a day with such a strict routine and tiny meals. Masha Davis, a registered dietitian nutritionist, reviewed this diet method in a BuzzFeed video and highlighted that while it introduces the importance of portion control, the portions are quite ridiculous and should not be encouraged. 8. Reduce everything. For aspiring K-pop idol trainees, there's one thing they fear apart from the weekly evaluation, the weekly weigh-ins. In an industry with sky-high beauty standards and constant camera presence, idols must maintain a weight below average. Cameras can distort body sizes, making these weigh-ins a crucial part of assessment. Euodius, a former trainee, shared with BBC the harsh reality, weight is an obsession. At these weigh-ins, trainers would announce your weight to everyone in the room. If you were over the designated weight, they would restrict your food, sometimes even taking away entire meals, leaving overweight trainees with just water. Former K-pop idol trainees Bin Hanul and Choi Yejin, who have undergone training in various entertainment agencies, shared the secret to calculating your ideal weight in the industry. The formula is your height in centimeters minus 120 equals to your ideal weight. This explains why many girls around 160 centimeters tall weigh at around 40 kilograms. Some even weigh less. For example, Sandara Park at 162 centimeters weighs around 39 to 41 kilograms at her peak activity with To Anyone and Zhang Wan Yong, who is 173 centimeters tall, weighs only 47 kilograms. Another trainee revealed how she would take constipation medicines to release fluids before weigh-ins at every agency. She also cut her hair and nails just in case. To avoid eating, one trainee placed a scale in front of the refrigerator, a harsh but effective method to suppress appetite. 7. The Red Bean Jelly Diet Not only female idols, their male counterparts also endure intense scrutiny about their weight. The oldest member of the legendary group Big Bang, Top, is considered one of the visuals of the second generation. But little did we know that young Top almost didn't make it into YG Entertainment because of his weight. At that time, despite his amazing rap skills, he was considered too chubby to meet the ideal standards of idols, and the company rejected him at his audition. This rejection pushed Top to start a dangerous diet. For an entire week, he survived only on water and Yang Gang, a jelly snack made of red bean. He combined this extreme diet with heavy exercise. In just 40 days, he lost 20 kilograms. Top eventually returned to YG Entertainment and was accepted as a trainee. However, while he did meet the weight requirements set by the company, it was not achieved in a healthy or sustainable manner. 6. One Apple a Day Diet Kwon Unbi, the former leader of Eyes One, made waves with her solo appearance at Waterbomb Seoul 2023, establishing herself as the Waterbomb Goddess for her beautiful body and captivating stage presence. On an episode of Strong Heart, she revealed that she is no stranger to rigorous weight loss regimes from her trainee days. To increase her chances of debuting, Unbi had no choice but to strictly control her weight. 
During those times, she only ate one slice of apple for breakfast and one slice every hour. In this way, she survived on just three apples over three days. Her confession greatly shocked everyone on the set. Currently, at 168 centimeters tall, Quan Umbi only weighs at 44.7 kilograms. 5. The Banana Diet Another celebrity who turned to extreme diet involving fruits is John Somi, a former member of IOI and currently a solo artist under the Black Label. During her time promoting with IOI, Somi revealed that she managed to shed 4 kilograms in a week by following a banana diet. I only ate one banana for breakfast, lunch, and dinner, said Somi. Being only 16 years old at the time, this statement garnered negative responses from netizens who criticized the imposition of such a strict diet on a young idol, especially considering the rigorous rehearsals and tight schedules they endure. Years later, Somi continues to focus on weight loss, but she claims to follow much healthier diets and incorporates exercise. At 172 centimeters tall, she weighs only 46.6 kilograms or around 102 pounds. She reveals that her waist is so tiny, she can wrap her hands around it. 4. Quail Egg Diet Sistar is one of the biggest girl groups from the second generation, known as the Summer Queens for their slim bodies and beautiful figures. One member, Soyu, shared that it is not easy to live up to that image. During an appearance on Strongheart, she shocked everyone with an extreme diet routine she used back then. I ate four quail eggs a day without the yolk. I practically starved. With exercise, I was able to lose 8 kilograms in a month. You know how tiny quail eggs, right? In addition to this diet, Soyu also engaged in a lot of exercise to burn extra calories. She mentioned that she did yoga in the morning, followed by running on the treadmill for another hour. After cardio, she headed to the dance studio to practice new choreographies and ended the day with a weigh-in. The singer further confesses that such a crash diet might actually ruin your metabolism. Can you survive this grueling regime? 3. Ice Cube Diet This must have been one of the most extreme situations. In a V-Live stream, members of TWICE, Nayeon, Jonghyun, Jihyo, and Momo were talking about their past as trainees and the tough times they faced to become part of TWICE. Momo shared a shocking experience during the conversation. She recounted how JYP Entertainment asked her to lose 7 kilograms in just one week, or she wouldn't be allowed to participate in a showcase. Momo took drastic measures to shed the weight quickly. I ate one cube of ice, but I thought that I might get fat with even that. While sleeping, I shed tears because I was afraid whether I would be able to get up or not the next day," said Momo. Despite her efforts, Momo couldn't lose the required weight within the time frame. She requested three more days to achieve the goal, which she managed eventually. When the other members saw her, they were shocked by her pale appearance, almost as if she were seriously ill. Yang Yan commented on the harshness of the situation, expressing disbelief that the company demanded such rapid weight loss, saying, the company told you to lose seven kilograms in a week? That's too much. Tell them to try it themselves. We totally agree with you, queen. Two, one meal a day. After hearing story of Momo who ate only ice cube, the idea of eating just one meal a day might not seem too bad. At least they're eating something, right? But imagine having only one meal as your routine for years, especially with the demanding schedule. It doesn't sound very sustainable, does it? Sadly, this is the reality for many K-pop stars. Take Shiny's Taemin, for example. When Taemin returned from his military service, he faced a lot of criticism because, for the first time in a long while, he had chubby cheeks. He admitted that he had gained 10 kilograms. Just around two months later, Taemin revealed his slim figure, returning to how he was before. Taemin revealed that his successful diet was thanks to eating only one meal a day, followed by exercise. He managed to shed weight from 72 kilograms to 66 kilograms. And after that, he hit a plateau. To push that even further, he survived the whole day only by eating a salad and yogurt and did cardio twice a day. When he appeared on another show back in 2018, Taemin revealed that he only ate one meal a day to maintain his weight. This is an indication that this one meal a day diet is something he has been practicing for years. Taemin is not the only one who keeps one meal a day as a lifestyle. Many other idol singers, including Hani from EXID, Dasom from Sistar, and Big Bang's Tae Young also disclosed that they ate only one meal a day to maintain their dreamlike figures. 1. IU Diet This is one of the most viral diet, 
with many fans trying it out and calling it the IU Diet Challenge. However, the singer never intended for people to follow it since it is clearly unrealistic and unhealthy. On a show called Night of TV Entertainment, back in 2013, IU, who was in her early 20s, revealed her unusual diet plan — one apple for breakfast, two sweet potatoes for lunch, and a protein powder drink for dinner. In addition to her limited intake, IU mentioned, I would do about an hour of aerobic exercises such as climbing stairs, stretching, and doing push-ups. This extreme plan helped her lose 5 kilograms in 5 days. Several YouTubers who experimented with this diet shared many downsides of this diet, including low energy, severe mood swings, and yo-yo effects. Since her debut at the tender age of 15 in 2008, we've witnessed IU's public struggle to overcome her body image. We're glad that she opens up about her struggles and has great fans that support her to reach a better place. During a 2015 concert in Busan, IU told her fans that she had gained weight. But one of them was quick to scold the star by shouting, What weight? The fan's voice was so clear that it seemed to fill up the entire concert hall. Look at this adorable, uplifting moment here. <laughs> IU later chose the video as the best of her 10-year career when she was asked to recall her most memorable moments. She said that she still watches the clip to this day, when she's feeling down. Let's show more support to these idols and be a little kinder when they seem unable to present their best selves forward. We're all human after all. Now let's dig deeper behind the industry facade to better grasp the immense pressure these idols face and what it truly takes to become a K-pop idol. Or check out these must-watch videos you might have missed. Subscribe now and don't let these fascinating stories pass you by.